If you had the opportunity to go back to 1997 to buy a piece of the internet during the dot-com bubble, would you? Well guys, you now have that chance because we're actually living in the exact same dot-com boom era again just before it takes off. We're living through the exact same era, but this time it's with blockchain technology and digital assets and it's going to be even bigger than the dot-com era. Now why would I say that? Because institutional adoption for cryptos and blockchain technology is happening at an even faster rate compared to the internet adoption during the 90s. Now that's crazy. It's happening so fast. We have officially entered the fourth industrial revolution. This is the new digital era. This revolution and idea, also known as the Great Reset, was created by the World Economic Forum and now being embraced by governments, policymakers, and companies all over the world. This is a technological shift and a digital transformation that will completely update and restructure the entire economy and our way of life. Everything will be linked to the internet of data and blockchain technology will be the infrastructure and foundation of the fourth industrial revolution and it is here to stay. And this is the reason why cryptocurrency regulations were snuck into the infrastructure bill. Nonetheless, you guys, this is the opportunity of a lifetime to become extremely wealthy by writing this to the top. This is exactly why you need to be paying attention to what's going on in the crypto space. The fourth industrial revolution is more significant and its ramifications will be more profound than any prior period in human history. This revolution is different in scale, scope, and complexity from any that have ever come before. We're so early, you guys, and that cannot be overstated, which is exactly why early buyers and investors in this cryptocurrency space are going to make millions, billions, and some will even become the new elites. Interestingly, so many people say that investing in cryptocurrency is risky. Well, I disagree. I think what's risky is not having any skin in the game at all. That's risky. Did you know that back in the 90s, many experts and people around the world actually thought that the internet would just be a fad? Just look at Dell Computer Corp's decade leading 91 863% rise, as measured from its closing stock price on the last trading day of 1989 through Thursday. That means a $5,000 investment in the computer maker at the start of the 90s would be worth more than $4.5 million today. You could have become a Dell millionaire by only investing $1,000. That's incredible. Can you imagine what your life would be like if you bought a piece of the internet or a tech stock like Google or Amazon when no one believed in them? Firstly, many people say that buying crypto is risky only because they have no idea what cryptocurrencies are. So this is exactly where the arrogance stems from. But once you finally understand what some of these cryptocurrencies are striving to achieve and how much money you can make by getting in early, then suddenly your entire outlook on cryptocurrencies and digital assets completely change. I guarantee it. Let this not be forgotten. There are winners and losers in this space. And it can be denied, that's a fact. Nonetheless, it's true that investing in some cryptocurrencies are far riskier than others, depending on many factors, of course. But this is exactly why you need to do your due diligence and your research and pay very close attention to what the elites and central banks are doing, not just what they're saying. By following these simple practices, you'll be able to give yourself a competitive edge while others are investing in meme coins and tokens that are eventually going to get regulated out of existence. But you'll be able to ensure that you're only investing in the highest quality digital assets ever created. Ones with immense utility, strong fundamentals, and real world use cases that are focused on solving global, multi-trillion dollar issues in the world. This is exactly how you protect your investments and yourself from losing everything. And trust me when I say that buying specific cryptocurrencies that check these criteria will make all the difference on what side of history you'll be on in the future. Now there are thousands of cryptos to buy in this space. 
but only a few of them are going to completely change the world forever. Therefore, we're invested in XRP. Ripple's digital currency, XRP, acts as a bridge currency to other currencies, which makes it easy for any currency to be exchanged for another, without having any intermediaries or third parties involved. Ripple has a very simple goal and clear vision, which is enabling the world to move value like it moves information today. This is why banks and financial institutions will adopt XRP, and they will use it as a bridge currency for the whole world. Additionally, the leaders behind XRP and Ripple, as well as many other prominent figures in government that do support XRP, have the most incredible track records and credibility. And trust me, they would not put their reputation on the line for just any company. That alone speaks volumes. XRP is one of the greatest digital assets ever created, and no other technology in existence can compare for what Ripple is about to accomplish. XRP is going to disrupt the entire financial system, and most people have no clue what is coming. Just how innovative companies like Google, Amazon, and Tesla took people by storm and changed the world forever. XRP is about to do the exact same thing and take the world by surprise very soon. We are in the last phases of the process. The traditional global payment system has not been updated in the last 50 years, but now it will be. And all the institutions and governments in the world are aware of this. That's why cryptos and blockchain are here to stay. You're going to see institutions and enterprises from all over the globe using DeFi and it's going to be embedded into easy to use products, services and markets all around the world. Currently, the XRP token and its protocol will allow banks and financial institutions to move money to all corners of the world easily, efficiently, cost effectively at a fraction of a penny and faster than ever at a rate of 3 to 5 seconds. The goal of XRP is to target all the money in the world, starting with cross-border payments and remittances. Global remittances and cross-border payments transaction value is expected to grow from $37.15 trillion in 2020 to $40 trillion by 2026. This is not even including all the other markets, such as derivatives, commodities, corporate bonds, government bonds, and even banknotes, which equates to more than one quadrillion dollars flowing through these markets every single year. This is just another reason for the urgent need for governments and institutions to start using XRP. This is revolutionary, and why every single central bank and financial institution on the planet is about to use XRP. The elites and global powers understand the power of these technologies and how it's going to transform the world. Unlike many other cryptocurrencies, Ripple and XRP aren't trying to go against the banking system. Instead, they are trying to work with the banks. That's what gives them a huge advantage, and that's just another reason why they will succeed. Not to mention, XRP has the power to completely end the entire global debt crisis and the ability to solve a liquidity crisis. So the value that XRP will bring to the world is astronomical. In conclusion guys, luckily we all have this once in a lifetime opportunity to be a part of the greatest wealth transfer in history and create generational wealth that would change our lives forever and our family's lives. So all I have to say to you guys is don't wait. Do your research, do your due diligence and educate yourself as much as you can so that you can have a very solid foundation and a clear understanding of this entire new asset class and how you can make money in it. Let me know what you found most intriguing about what we covered in this video and what would you do if you became a millionaire or a billionaire. I'd love to hear what you guys have to say. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below and I'll try to respond to every single one of them. If you're new here, my name is Vandell and I'm going to be bringing out a new video every single week covering cryptocurrency, investing, money, and personal finance for free. So subscribe to the channel, 
Again, thank you for watching, and that's going to wrap it up for this video, and I'll see you in the next one. So you listen to me, and you listen well. Are you behind on your credit card bills? Good. Pick up the phone and start dialing. Is your landlord ready to evict you? Good. Pick up the phone and start dialing. Does your girlfriend think you're a fucking worthless loser? Good. Pick up the phone and start dialing. I want you to deal with your problems by becoming rich. Yeah.